Hello. How are you today, Virgo? Virgo, let us see what's in your energy this week. Two of Swords, Virgo. What has you so rooted? In this energy, Virgo, it's like movement is too value or unnecessary movement is not affordable till unless you hear exactly what you want to hear what you need to hear to move forward there's a very specific catalyst required for movement Let's find out this judgment. Page of Wands, Nine of Cups, Ten, or oh, Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so you're waiting for good news. <laughs> we got that. Just to show you. Yeah, this is all this is. Not only just waiting for judgment. Oops. Not only are we waiting for your so-called judgment, but you're actually waiting for good news. Extraordinarily good news. Extraordinary good news, Virgo. Eight of Pentacles. Oh, excuse me. Did I say Eight of Pentacles? I meant Five of Pentacles. I'm calling everything Eight of Pentacles. I kept on seeing Eight of Pentacles, I think, so many times over the last two weeks that now it's just... Like, you know, when you blink, you look at the sun or look at one of those color blocks and then you blink and you see the after effect. That's what the Eight of Pentacles is doing to me, Virgo. Which, I believe the Eight of Pentacles is Virgo energy. I believe so. Anyway, Five of Pentacles. I believe that's Taurus energy. Of course, it's like 6 a.m., so I'm not entirely coherent. Um, two of Wands, well someone's making a decision to rush forward, but they're making a decision to rush forward under a Five of Pentacles. Curious. Curious, curious, curious. What's that lover's hangman? What's the hangman? Oh, see, I knew there was going to be an Eight of Pentacles. It's like an Eight of Pentacles all the time. Everything gets an Eight of Pentacles. And I see the Eight of Pentacles is <laughs> timing. Not ready yet. That's what that is. Still work to be done. Virgo, I don't know if this is you waiting on a love connection. Is it a love connection, Virgo, or is it just an opportunity that you'll really love. I mean, it could be not necessarily related to a person. It could be related to a gain, a goal, an action, an achievement. Either way, Virgo, right now you are putting things on pause until you get the specific achievement. I'm not going to clarify it because we are dealing with the collective. What this does tell me, Virgo, is that whatever you're waiting on, whatever achievement you're waiting on, it's not ready yet. 
I don't know if this is a person. It could be a person for you, Virgo. It could be the next phase opportunity you're waiting for under judgment that hasn't come yet. Well, it's coming, Virgo. It is coming. Lovers, clarified by hangman, clarified by eight of pentacles. It's coming, but it's not ready yet. It's being worked on. Judgment, obviously, when you get the message, you can move forward. Pretty basic message there. Virgo, that's what I have for you today. If you're waiting on a person or if you're waiting on some sort of general opportunity, regardless if it's a person or an event, a decision, it's not ready yet. Virgo, let me know if you like this reading. If you do, give me a thumbs up or a comment. If you would like to see more, please don't hesitate to tune in for the next one, next reading. Until the next reading, I do wish all of you the most beautiful day. Bye-bye.